We are at Aldi's. It's time to get some easy food. So let's go hit it. Um, video in um, Aldi's. Six kids, Aldi's, camera, it wasn't good. We just we just had to quit. We just totally quit. All right, so we're gonna bring it inside and I'm gonna show you what I got and ideas I put together for just some really easy, semi-homemade, not really homemade at all, meals. Here we go. Okay, so here it all is. I'm gonna take you in parts, but this is a $215 shopping spree for eight of us. And I mean, I'm going to not deny the fact that we kind of splurge for the lack of buying groceries for three weeks. So, I mean, we haven't bought groceries for three weeks. So, here we go. All right. Let me start off with modern conveniences, kind of my non-food items. I'm not big into plastic wear, but... Man, it sure is making life easy because that's the size of my sink. Not that it's bad, but... So I got the plastic containers. Thank you to my wonderful, awesome subscriber who reminded me of these. These are at Aldi's right now here, right now too. So I'm not going to lie. I have dinner started in one of these. I'm actually doing... Um, somebody had gifted us a fra frozen hamburger, hamburger meatloaf. So I'm actually... I did two of these and I'm cooking it in the crock pot and then I'm going to put the meatloaf on it and finish cooking. So yay, I bought four of them. Four of them. Okay. Some paper towels and then just to kind of keep things easier for us since all my stuff is packed up, I bought two of these deep containers. So let's go into dinners. I know I'm just throwing stuff away. Alright, so a lot of convenient meals. I bought one of these so we can have one of these coming up to make life easier. Um, they have the hams. So this is um, eight bucks for this ham. It was nine and a half pounds. It was 89 cents a pound. So to go with that, I did buy scalp potato slices. I would normally make it from scratch, but not today. Frozen vegetables is because we do a lot of chicken and yellow rice, so I wanted to have those ready. I have everything I needed for that. All right, I bought two boxes of stroganoff, two boxes of hamburger. They're hamburger helper. I don't like hamburger helper, but listen, I'm going to have to make do. Um, next is, and I went ahead and bought ground turkey and ground beef. I'm probably going to mix them. I did have some beef in the um, freezer, so I can do taco shells. So there's one. This is like three days right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven meals just there. So the meatloaf, what I'm doing with the meatloaf is I seen these, or not the meatloaf, the meatballs. I seen these. And I'm like, you know what? This would be awesome on meatballs. So I went ahead and got this for meatballs. So that's one less thing I have to do. I don't have to buy the big thing. I got the chicken Marcella with chicken. I got um, two jars of Alfredo sauce to do chicken Alfredo. So here again, we're at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine week and a half worth of meals dinners right there for the eight of us yes so i went a little bit bonkers on lunch very pre-packaged oh i've never been a big user of these i love these now all right so let me lay out lunch okay on to lunches this is not my usual lunch get but you know what we're making do so first off we picked up eight boxes of chicken pot pies they're easy, they're convenient. When the kids want them, they're good to go. We picked up these shredded steak rolled tortillas just for something different. Um, I picked up two of these cheddar soup mixes. It makes eight servings. And then um, two of these three bean chilies. So we will have that for lunch from time to time. And I thought I could add cooked chicken in that, throw it in, ham, whatever. Or ground beef and put it in that in the crock pot um, I picked up a couple of these to try just to keep myself portion controlled 
We got the beef and bean burritos because they work out good. I picked up these to try them for the first time. Just something, again, easy. And two cans of raviolis. Sweet potatoes. We'll put the sweet potatoes in the crock pot and we'll eat those for a lunch. There we have um, salad mix, which will go with dinner. Um, the little kid thingies that you get with the pouches, the food pouches. A drink mix for me. Applesauce. We like cookies at the end of our meal. I also picked up these. These were on clearance at 99 cents at Aldi's. Because I figured I have frozen fruit and we can do that in the crock pot. I did buy six loaves of bread. They're 50 cents today. Um, the chips. I've got two bags of chips. I did buy um, the stevia cucumbers for the salad. Fruit rounds. We love the fruit rounds. Two boxes of fruit rounds. Had to grab a tube of toothpaste. Incidentals. Um, chicken meat. So this I think I have... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I probably have about another nine days worth of lunches. Now, we also went and picked up a thing of yogurt. This is not very much yogurt. Um, I picked up the yogurt. I also picked up, see, more of those. Okay, I just had to have the coffee creamer. I couldn't help myself. Another round of bananas. And then I had to have this. I'm trying this. I've never had it, but I mean, I could use a chocolate glazed donut in my life. Eggs, we'll boil those up for snacks. So there you go. This is our haul. These are kind of our menu plan ideas that we're going to use this week coming up. <laughs> I'm going to have to pull out some waffles and pancakes that I have in my freezer so that we can make life easier that way. Um, I'll give you a little preview. This is some of the stuff we've got going on. Like these are the snacks and then I'll bag up. The animal crackers, I got graham crackers, I got. So I don't let them in here all the time, but I let them in here some of the time. So yeah, there's some of my other stuff. All right. So there you go. There is our grocery haul from Aldi's. I'm so thrilled. It's my first shopping trip of October. And we're almost to the end. Um, I'm hoping after that this trip, my brain will be at ease. I will be eating kind of more on our schedule that I could do a better menu plan because I'm going to have to plan out my food very well. So if you like this, if you like the haul, you like kind of like my thinking that went through, I will tell you I did not go to the store with a plan. I just made my plan at the store and wish I had a notepad to write it down. Um, but let me know. Like, should share, like, should share, share and subscribe. I'm sweating to pieces. It's Florida in fall. Anyways, I will talk to you later. Peace.